subscriber. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Currently, we are trying to get out of a reading slump. I have been in one all summer and I actually had the opposite intention also heard it was to read more books and it didn't end up being that way. So we're gonna get out of our reading slump. I figured I would kind of keep myself accountable by making a reading vlog. There are definitely books that I've been wanting to buy from the bookstore, but I keep telling myself that I am not going to give myself permission to buy new books until I've gone through the ones on my shelf currently. So that is what we're going to do this week. We're just going to get through our reading list. Um, if you have any book recommendations, please feel free to let me know because I'm always on the lookout. I wanted to first start off with showing you guys what I'm currently reading. I have mentioned these two books before in my favorites video um, from a couple of weeks ago. Number one, I've, I feel like I've been reading this book forever, but it's taken me so long to read this and I'm honestly just like disappointed myself about it. This is Page Boy by Elliot Page. It's a memoir. I really love the cover so much. Honestly, like not even that thick of a book, so for me to be taking this long to read it is beyond me. But I am really enjoying this book a lot. I will say, however, it's a little confusing for me. I find myself kind of like struggling every now and then to kind of keep up with like where in the timeline we are. So I think that's like my only complaint to be honest, which maybe isn't like really a big one or maybe I'm the only one who notices that. I recommend it anyway because I am really enjoying it. So. And then we have Stephen King's Joyland. Um, I'm actually really enjoying this book a lot. This is the illustrated edition. So it has like a bunch of I don't even know if you can see it, but it has a lot of like very uneven pages inside of like an amusement park that this guy is working at. There is a murder of some sort, of course. So that and this one, that's what we're reading right now. We're going to start off with these and we're not going to touch any other book until we get through these. I can get through it if I really just like set my mind to it. that was delivered today that wasn't supposed to be here until tomorrow but it got here today and I'm so excited I can't even open it there we go so I was on the Bagu website and they had like very gaga poo colors like for all their Bagus Urban Outfitters had colors that I thought were just like out of stock everywhere they ended up having the one that I wanted in stock, and this is the Ivory Medium Crescent Back. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I said I wasn't gonna do it because I was trying to convince myself that I didn't need like another bag for Disney for a trip next month, but honestly, like, let's be real. I saw that they had this color in stock and I just had to buy it, so I'm really glad I did. I actually haven't treated myself to a bag or bag in like three years, so honestly, it's not like I do this one. And it was between this one and the one called, I think, like, Blue Bonnet or something like that. It was a tough one, guys. But honestly, at the end of the day, like, I am a sucker for this. I'll have to have, like, another video soon just kind of show me. Maybe another what's in my bag. Super excess, but let's get back to the video. like about two more chapters and I feel like I feel like in certain Stephen King books like you'll reach two chapters in and sometimes it'll be like very slow before it picks up it's really hard not to just like talk about it but like honestly like no spoilers here um if you are a Stephen King fan like let me know if you've read this one I'm really liking it so far I'm excited to read more later I know this is a book that I'm gonna get through pretty quickly because it is quite a page turner so yeah I'm really enjoying it so far so we're gonna take a small break 
I'm just realizing I still have my earbud in and I don't even know how long it's been in my ear because I'm not listening to anything but I just heard it go off and I'm like right now I'm gonna go and get something to eat I haven't really eaten much today so I think I'm just gonna go grab a burger for me my partner and my kid really quick and I brought my book <laughs> putting our daughter down so I'm gonna use this time to kind of start winding down we're just gonna spend the rest of the night just kind of catching up on more reading we are at a good pace today so yeah it's very easy for me to get distracted on my phone at this time so I'm going to just try and get some reading done instead and then probably just call it a night I hope that you guys are having a great night Hello, it is the next day, uh, Tuesday. I'm like hoping the camera doesn't fall because I have it like in a very, a very sus spot. I don't know. But um, anyways, right now we are about to go head over to my favorite juice spot. I feel like I'm there like in every other video that I post, but honestly, I just love it so much. It's a perfect spot to just kind of relax if you want just kind of like a chill vibe. So that's where we're gonna go right now. I meant to go a little bit earlier today, but my partner had to go to work. So right now it is 1238 um which is still a pretty good time i really just want to get more reading done i feel like i'm on a roll right now and i just want to keep going with it so today we're actually reading page boy so we're gonna switch it up a bit i read a lot of my stephen king book yesterday so i really want to change it up um hopefully i can finish them both like around the same time that is the plan for right now i will see you guys at the juice shop I had the best afternoon. It was honestly like the coziest afternoon. I'm so glad that I ended up doing that. I felt like I was reading for like two hours, um, but that felt so nice. I got a lot of reading in. I feel like I'm starting to enjoy this book a lot more. There's definitely parts like throughout the chapters that are a little bit like difficult to read. I feel like this is definitely one of those books too where I kind of have to make sure I'm in the right headspace. I feel like that's how it is for most books though. Like I feel like there's some that are definitely like a more deep and like triggering and I feel like with books like that like you definitely have to make sure you're in the right headspace. I'm so excited we're halfway through the book. Um, I don't know at this point I'm not sure if I'm gonna finish this one or the Stephen King book. I feel like I'm kind of reading them both like pretty equally so I don't know but right now we are about to go to Ulta very quickly because I need some wellness gummies that we just ran out of that my partner uses so we're gonna go get that right now. It's just been a very cozy Saturday afternoon. I'm so happy about it, um, but I'm feeling really good today. We're gonna go make a stop at Ulta really quick and then go home. Good 
morning guys i am up pretty early today probably gonna regret it later and get some reading done So happy I ended up getting through this book. I feel like making this vlog was so helpful. I have been wanting to get through this book for a while and it kind of just like allowed me space to just kind of like slow down. I actually really enjoyed it. Definitely recommend it. Like I said earlier in the vlog, it can be triggering at times. So just be mindful of that. I honestly loved it so much. I'm really happy that I ended up picking it up for my own personal collection. I definitely want to continue making more vlogs like these. I feel like it's definitely so helpful and keeping myself accountable with my reading list. So little by little, I want to get through my shelf and the books that I have on there. I am really happy. I feel like I've got a lot of reading momentum going and I kind of want to stick to that. So I still have Joyland by Stephen King that I'm reading right now and I'm not quite finished with it, but I did get halfway through that because then I just ended up getting really into um, page voice. So I just ended up sticking to that book. So I finished that one quicker. I also want to start a new book. So if you've been around since January, I think I did it in January, I made a little book jar. So I basically wrote down the names of all the books that I have on my shelf because it was actually a goal of mine at the beginning of the year to get through my shelf reads and not buy any. So I haven't bought any new books. That's a lie. I bought Page Boy. But yeah, I made a little book jar for moments like these where I felt stuck and I didn't know what book to start next. Also, sorry if it's so dark. This is the best lighting I could have, but it's also like almost eight o'clock in the evening. I really just wanted to film this portion of the video and an outro. We're just dealing with this light, but at the moment, I wish you guys could see it because it's gorgeous. At the moment, the sky is looking like cotton candy, even though you, oh my gosh, how perfect, the little bird. How perfect was that moment, honestly? But yeah, um, like I was saying this video, dude, another bird, you guys are cute. Anyways, cotton candy's guy. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna do the jar. Let's see what we're gonna start. So along with Joyland, we'll also be starting. Well, okay, so this one, and I've been hoping to pick this one out. Um, this is what I got. I got Mother Thing by Ainsley Hogarth. I'm so excited. So this has been at the top of my list since January and I heard a lot of really good things. So I also, I realized that this is one that I don't have in my personal library. So I want to get this one. Okay. If I decide to go to the store and get this one, then, then that's just what's going to happen because I don't, I don't know. I mean, that's what I picked out. What are you gonna do? So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. This was so much fun to film. I'm honestly going to keep up with these because I love to read and this honestly just like ignited my motivation for it again. So thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. I'm going to finish off the rest of my night, probably reading a little bit more. My partner went to go get us some food, so I'm just gonna eat some dinner and enjoy this beautiful con candy. I hope that you guys are having a great day or night, whatever time it is when you're watching this. And I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye.